Hi, Rumians. I'm Drushnik. Thank you for being here and welcome back to another episode of The Lion's Roar in our Crusader Kings 3 series. Let's go over the multiple wars that we can declare before we figure out what to do. So, I can declare eight wars, of which five, two, four, five, yes, <laughs> are uh, colored green and three are absolutely red. Which makes sense. Aquitaine, ha, <laughs> much stronger. Sweden, much, much, much stronger. Mecklenburg. Oh, who, you, okay. Um, also stronger. Uh, you know, with my allies, it's he's inferior, but it would be a holy war. And then the other Slovianskans can um, join. And why would I want to be there, you know? Why would I want to be there? I could go for the duchy and I could grow here, but then I would be enveloping Sweden somewhat. It doesn't seem very attractive to me. So, with those gone, let's see. Nordmark. We can go for the duchy again. That's a pretty big duchy, but again, the same thing. Why would I want to be all the way up out there? And it's also very, very bad for, you know, your legitimacy. And <laughs> I'm not at all the de jure ruler of this part of Europe. I'm not even the de jure ruler of this. And I'm having troubles there, so, nah. Then we have Denmark in this part. So we would have this, and then this would be Aquitaine, and this would be us. Yes, we could do that, but again, it's a holy war, so huh, other Asatru rulers could join. Not a good idea. Then we have Vladimir, which is just a small thing, but pfft, why? Now, this one is interesting. This one is to press Count Diederich's claims, which is just this part. But remember, this this guy, this guy is the dude who in the last episode forged a claim on Liège. He also has a claim on Cambrai. Um, I might want to do this. I might want to do this because he's annoying me. He's annoyed me and I'm not that forgiving. <laughs> And then we can declare war on this little Count Robin of Cologne. It's a holy war, however. Uh, he's a Lollard. Um, mm -mm -mm. And we can take this, which would not be a bad idea, I think. Now, I don't know who else out there is a Lollard, though. Because, our, for example, Duchess Adelaide of Savoy is a Lollard. <laughs> and um, let's look at Bavaria. No, you're a good Catholic. You're a good Catholic. Let's see, who else? Neustria? Catholic. Catholic. It's probably easier if I just do this, isn't it? Um, <laughs> okay, so Lollardy is basically over here. So that's just Savoy, but she's my ally. I don't really have to worry about that. Well, good. Good. Um, <laughs> she can't declare war on me. So, do, 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 do. I could do that. I could get Cologne. And Cologne, let's look at this county. Oh, it's pretty developed. It's quite good. Oh, I, oh, I like it. Oh, I like it more than I like this. Although that's pretty developed too. But that would be pressing somebody... Uh, I'd be pressing somebody else's claims anyway. So, let's see. Um, this is a holy war. This would become mine. Yeah. yeah. Let's... Should we do this? I'm probably, again, making a stupid decision on a whim. Let's do it. I declare war on Count Robin! Robin! I'm gonna raise everybody. Ah, it feels good to be at war. Wait, why are you not moving? Oh, you're still gathering. Okay. We have our commander. Not the best dude, but he's got the siege things at least. Oh. My son and heir, Radboud, is an unusually calm child. When the others play their wild games, Radboud often withdraws to some silent corner. He does not speak a lot, but I can tell he's always thinking about something. Oh dear. A pensive child. And an even battle! Huh! Uh-oh. 
We might lose this one. Our knight was maimed by an enemy soldier. That's bad. We are sort of winning. It looks like... Yes, we're gonna win. Okay. Whew. Whoops. Okay. Well, that was slightly stressful. Let's siege this down, though. You're already coming back. You want to fight me again? Yes, you do. To nurture relationships between the next generation of rulers is a duty we should not neglect, says, queen, says the queen. Some of your more influential vassals have children that I am certain Ratba would benefit from knowing. Oh, I agree. Mm, 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 mm. Especially since he doesn't talk a lot. So, yes. Let's send him over to my uncle's son, Simon. Because he's probably his heir. Yes. Are you gonna? Yes, two thinkers. You're gonna, you're gonna love playing together. I don't know. There's probably not a lot of bad stuff coming out of those two. They're just gonna be thinking and philosophizing. Do you think that Daddy would get angry if we would do something naughty? I don't know. Let's think about it. What are the pros and the cons? <laughs> wow, poor boys. Poor, poor, poor boys. Oh, you really want to go at it, don't you? Uh. Yeah, so you, Savoy, what did you do? Oh, I don't care. My son and heir Radboud was <gasps> captured by Jarl Snorri. No! No, 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 no. You are a terrible, fearless maniac person. I want my son back. Yo. <laughs> I want him back. Handsome. If I give you everything for favor? No. Wow. I lose everything. You know what? I have another boy. I don't care. <laughs> oh. I'm the worst parent ever. I really am the worst parent ever. It's not like I don't care about my sons, but I've got three of them, you know? So if one of them dies... Yeah. <sighs> Do I really care that much? I don't think so. I can use this money in a better place, you know? Oh, I have another combatant. And he does not contribute to war score. Which makes it fun for me. Uh, no, no, I can't... Ah, oh, I can't ransom anybody? Well, boo-hoo. Boo-hoo. Why do you continue to raid me? I'm very unhappy. What do you own? You called him a Visby. Where is that? Oh, there. Here. Okay. Uh-oh. 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 Sweden is attacking us. Okay. Let's think this through. If we don't want to lose this... We need to get an alliance with him. He's got a daughter. So, really, we need this daughter. And you can marry my eldest. <gasps> we'll not accept. You do not want an alliance. Yes, because I was already declared war on by Sweden. Uh-oh. Savoy, Bavaria, I need you. I need to get Cologne fast. Hmm, not good. I could get maybe somebody else to ally with me. Who can I promise my children to? Hey, you. You have... You, you're not too far away. You have a girl. He's gonna, you're gonna say no, aren't you? Whew. Really no. That's a real, real no. Oh, because it's your eldest. Maybe I should go for the younger one. Even though she is... She has consumption. But for now, it'll work. For now, it'll work. No? Really? 
Okay, different faith minus the thousand. So we need to stay within the faith. Okay, so... Mm -mm -mm. Oh, you have 1700. Uh, that's not gonna work. <laughs> hmm. Who are you? A lollard. Might work. Do you have a girl? Is this, this is a girl. Oh. A rowdy girl. Yeah, why not? Okay, good. Come help. Help me. Yeah, this is what happens when you accept alliances. You, you get suckered into things. I've learned this the hard way. Okay, I have another boy. Romania, really? Oh, <gasps> three thousand troops! You have no girls. You have no girls. You do have a sibling. Mm, married. It's too bad. Um. <laughs> you can't have much left. No. Oh. You're all Muwaladi, so that's not going to work. What about you? You're weak. Weak, 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 weak. Scotland? Oh, you're a Satru. You are all terrible people. You are all terrible people. Okay, um, I, I'm guessing Denmark is out of, out of the question, too. Yeah. Okay, well, we're going to have to do it with this, I think. <laughs> Unless you are promising. You're Catholic. Oh, you only have boys. Ah, oh, man. Ah, oh, man. It's a pain in the butt that um, a friend of Aquitaine doesn't want to do this. But we also have this guy. Hey, hey look at this. We have, we have, we have, we have... A seven-year-old, a thinker, for my one-year-old. Good. Nope, oh, nope, nope. That's not the betrothal. Thank you. Okay, let's see if we can uh, get one big army and defeat the Swedes. That'd be cool. And if not, then we will lose this part. It's not going to be a huge deal. Not not for the the purpose of this series, but of course it's going to be very annoying. So I don't. I really don't want this to happen. Let me be clear about that. Now I would like. I don't have the money. I could ask for money though. I would like to get more levies. still not strong enough to defeat Sweden. And I don't think he's in other wars, no. But they're gonna help me get Cologne first and then we're gonna defend whatever we have left to defend. We'll see. Very risky. And the chances of me dying in battle are not low. Which means they are high. <laughs> And they are coming with 11,000 troops. They're bringing everybody and their brother. Which is not good. We're gonna finish this real quick. And I can check if I can get mercenaries, but I, that would put me in debt immediately. And it's probably not worth it. Okay, so I captured... Oh, I got somebody. Look at that! Ooh, I can get money. Money, money, money. Money, money, money. Francois? We cook. Fine. Fine. Oh, ten money. Ten monies? I'll do it for ten monies. Okay. So... Question is, are we defending? And if so, where? Let's at least get back to our homeland. 
Um, so we have 7k troops. They will never, ever... ...fight us. We have to kill these guys. We have to deny them the possibility to join up with the rest. We have to deny them this possibility. There we go. So that's one battle that we will win. It's not gonna help as much, but it's gonna do something. There we go. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Um, <laughs> how many do we have here? Okay, we have some more troops. Can we get mercenaries? No. Okay, unless we ask the Pope for gold. Which is a serious option right now. 105 gold. Let's just do this. Okay, 243 gold now. Which means... The question is, is this really worth it? But I could get... Uh, oh, these guys would be good, but I can't pay afford them. I could get the Palabian Band of Dannenberg. They have horsemen. 762 horsemen. <laughs> Do you mostly have levies? 400 heavy swords? 100 horsemen? 35 skirmishers? They don't really have men-at-arms here. What do we have? We have a lot of men-at-arms. Should we try to fight them? Maybe definitely with the horsemen, we should be able to... I'm gonna try it. It's now or never, boys. Now or never. What's the difference between these two? These are much cheaper. What? 334 horsemen, two knights. 332 konni. Okay, so these are the Polish guys and two knights. This is a worse commander. Oh, he is he's imprisoned. It's probably a better idea to get this, the Polabian band. <sighs> it would put me in debt quickly. Let's try it. Let us try this battle. Let us try it. Maybe we can win. If we get lucky, we will win. Okay. So we have one big army here. One big Dutch army. Now, if you would be so kind and join me... While I march to my death. <laughs> that would be fantastic. So these guys might not be able to get there in time if we go and attack these dudes. Now, let's see. The best commander I have is the Count of Brabant. He's an unyielding defender. Hills, mountains, and wetlands. Plains. Okay. So I guess we're going to do it with him. I'm very scared. We might be able to pull it off. If we pull it off, it's going to be the heist of the century. The century's almost over, you know, so... <laughs> oh yes, we're attacking them. 
Oh, my, my waters, my, oh, my everything. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Come here, come help. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, this battle. Oh, they are winning. Come on! Baron, join! Good. Odds are even, odds are even. We have a lot of, a lot of men at arms who are in favor, but these guys, nobody is really disfavored. However, Come on, you can do this. I have the utmost faith in you. There is another army from the north coming in, but they will arrive too late. We will take this battle. Sweden, eat this. I don't know how I got the queen pregnant, but I did. Oh, I'm so proud of you guys. I am so proud of you guys. You have no idea how proud I am. Okay. If we are lucky, we'll capture the King of Sweden, but not right now. We captured some combatants. Let's see. Would be good to... Here, look. A giant. A chieftain. If we would ransom him, we could get 50 gold and avoid going into debt. Haha. -ha. Do we want him on the battlefield against us? Why not? His prowess is pretty good, though, but he's old. He's near death. Okay, let's let's ransom him. I want the money. He's gonna die soon. So, <laughs> let's get a new counselor, because apparently our chancellor died. He must have been uh, on the battlefield. Very risky to be my chancellor. But we have Mayor Blanca of Bonn. She's a woman, though. We have somebody else, who's a man, who's also 11. <laughs> oh, I'm terrible. Mm, our best friend is the Count of Nassau now. He didn't actually get it. He would make a better spymaster. Diederik, are you good at diplomacy? No, you are not. You are most definitely not. Okay. And I'm not going to piss you off, because you've been a good boy. So, um... Mm, 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 I think I'm going to... Well, why not give it to her, then? She's deceitful, brave, and vengeful. She's a gay, low-born mayor. <laughs> you are a low-born mayor, too. She is stronger than you are. Well, let's assign you, Mayor Blanca. You are now the chancellor. I'm not too happy with this, but... Hang on, where are we going? Let's, let's think this through. We should probably get this back. That's true. probably give this back. They don't... haven't sieged down anything else. And they'll probably... should we... I'm guessing we should get these guys, huh? But now my friends' armies are not following me anymore, which is confusing to me. Yes, let's just get this back. This army is coming back. Let's take them quickly over here. I think my friends will come help me. Please say so. Yes. Oh, now there are two fights happening. That's probably not the best thing ever. Um... <laughs> Well, I was going for August, so sway scheme power, inspire. Ooh, offer vassalization acceptance plus 25. I do like that. We're gonna win this battle, hopefully, before these guys arrive. And then we have another battle on our hands. There we go. Nope, battle's still raging. We really need these guys, but they are caught up. Come here, come here, come here. You won. Come here. Oh, good, good, good. They're coming. Winning all these battles is very good for war score, obviously. Mm, we might actually be winning this war. Which is fantastic. However, I couldn't have done this, you know, um, pressing claims. Because of the prestige associated with asking all of these allies to join me in the war. Since this is a defensive war, I can do this for free. 
My steward died. All the good people are dying. Count Jan of Dithmarschen. You've been a good boy. You've you've given me money, so actually I'm gonna make you a steward. It sounds like a good idea. Now, I would prefer you to promote culture um, here in uh, Münster. And we also need to convert its faith. Now, did I imprison anybody else? No, that's too bad. I really could use more money. And Aquitaine, oh, Aquitaine is in a civil war. Oh, that would have been the time to attack. But no, now I don't have the time. Dang it. Sweden, what are you doing to me? Oh, these guys are involved in the war. Oh, if they become independent, that will be my time to strike. Anton, yes, hello, my son. I again have a son. Oh man, oh man, oh man. I have to stop now. <laughs> it's um, the end of the episode. But, 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 we are doing quite well. And I hope that we can win this war. That would be a terrible blow to Sweden and very good for me. Um, the problem is it won't weaken him significantly. And it has economically weakened me. Um, the Pope is unhappy. I'm going to ask him for money. So I'm only holding on to lands I owned, but not really getting anything from this. And I, oh, I'm so upset about missing this opportunity. This could be the best opportunity to declare, but if they win, this could be a good, good, good thing for me. So let's see what happens there. And uh, Maastricht, well, for now, we are still dreaming about it. Unfortunately, we can't suddenly claim this, which is, I think, a pity. I think, I think we should be able to get something out of this if if we win we should be able to go to sweden and say hey yo if you want peace give me maastricht but we can't but anyway thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed this episode if you did hit the like button and please consider subscribing it helps out immensely new episodes come out regularly until we finish this series off and i have a very very nice new series in pedo so stay tuned for that and i hope to see you next time